Hey. Oh. Get him. It looks Ooh. like a bunch of sketch drawings, man. It's so cool. Hey. hey. Hey, what up, everybody? It's the Normies coming at you with the pure hype that is Star Wars Visions. <laughs> what? Uh, episode one, The Duel. What? Oh, I'm so sorry. Hey, can I say yeah, something? I, 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 I wasn't here for the trailer reaction, but I watched both stuff end up when I when I came home, because Chris was like, you have to watch it. Oh, the, the you trailer? You have to watch both. The so, trailer? Yeah, so I did, and I'm hyped. I'm excited. It's pretty dope. I'm so, I'm so happy that it's going to be like, I'm assuming each episode is going to be a different animation style. Yeah, it's, it's a different it's a different studio for every episode. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. They also did this with the Matrix, so I hope we right. I hope we do the Animatrix next. Yeah, which, I, which I've been telling these these non Matrix fans for years about. Non Matrix I, fans. Look, <laughs> I, I like the Matrix. first one. Two and three were good, not as great as the first <laughs> one, and I, I just never caught Animatrix. Yes. That's all. Animatrix but, is great. I've never seen Animatrix. I'm hoping these Animatrix are is amazing. It, it it like you know it completes. I'm it. hoping these are true standalone <laughs> episodes, anthology pieces. You know, kind of how What If is is mm -hmm. doing it, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, very excited to see uh, the different animation studios. And, I I wish I, I hope that it's gonna be like you know a standalone anthology series, but at the same time, I wish there was like an overarching theme of like you know like some like major villain or something, you know gotcha. what I mean? Yeah, because nice. Star Wars is, is great with its its villains. Uh, yeah. I see what you mean, as though it's it's a the same through line, but it's all done by different studios and different animators. Yeah. 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 I, I love the Animatrix, and so I'm hoping that this is going to be similar. The Animatrix kind of shows each episode is an individual person's brush with the Matrix, and I kind of hope this is similar where each episode is about somebody's brush with like some part of the I'm Star so Wars so universe, you off. know? <laughs> I think you, you have to hold the other button to turn it off. Which button? How many buttons? This always happens when we bust this out. <laughs> the other buttons. Look at oh, it. Oh, that's so yeah, cool I was gonna though. Say, yeah, it no, looks like so a lot of All right, don't hold it, just tap, the, tap it. Uh, ah. Beautiful. Put it away. <laughs> uh, anyway, so, yeah. Sorry, I, I, Gamer. I, I heard what you were saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry about that. I forgot that's that right. it's always obnoxious when you turn it. Well, we got it. That's the point. I'm so sorry. Uh, I, actually, I don't want this breaks. to do anything with any Skywalkers, any Palpatines, any mainline story. Give me yeah. pure, unadulterated Star Wars shit that I don't know nothing about. Just like, oh, just, yeah. yeah. Yep. Boy. Yep. Yep. I, I, I want to see Palpatine. I want to see animated Palpatine. Nah, I, I want to see names Palpatine. and characters of people I've never, I don't recognize. I want goofy ass Grogu. I want all the ridiculous <laughs> names. Give me yep. everything. That's what I want. That's what I'm here for. All the things that made the Mandalorian good. Yes. Mm -hmm. Guys, uh, watch this on Disney Plus, please. Support the official release. We are not a market substitute. Nope. Like and subscribe and share if you enjoy us and our conversation. Once again, we're the normies. We out here. Trying to trying to watch every relevant piece of content out there and, and hang out with you while we do it. Mm -hmm. You can check out the uncut of this on Patreon. It's a short episode. Check out all our social medias. Pick your poison. There's a lot of them. <laughs> anyway, let's stop. Pick your poison. Sweet. If this is anything prequel, and I'm gonna kick this fucking table over. Ah, uh, hey, that's the best part of the prequel. All right, dueling fates is. <laughs> yeah, that's true. It is. Oh, uh, we didn't decide what language we're watching it in, so whatever we get is what we get. Japanese. I oh, I want it Japanese. better be. Yeah, I want Japanese. Yeah, it better be. Kamikaze, Kamikaze Duka. Duka. That must be the name of the studio. Mm -hmm. Do you think Kathleen Kennedy saw what Kevin Feige was doing with What If and she was like, hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, they haven't been in production on this shit for a long yes. time. Oh, so. okay, okay. Maybe I mean, not because there are shorter episodes in different animation studios doing them. What planet is this? Commonality. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Damn. Sweet, man. That's neat. It's the Kira Kurosawa shit up in this old school Japanese samurai. So even got the Cut film aesthetic. <laughs> He's got his little hat on. <laughs> Dude, Dude, come on. His little rice hat. This is Yo, amazing. this is sick already. This is amazing already. I love that it's black and white. Yeah. It's got film grain and what, film noise like on color, it. Though. A little pop of color. Yeah. Oh, it's CG. It looks like it's in it an old, old school mm -hmm. theater. Oh, he's the same um, species as the guy who flew with Lando in uh, Return of the Jedi. Yeah. In, in the uh, Millennium Falcon. Yep. Yeah. Yep. That looks like the mining car. Yeah. And, uh, Bro. Oh, oh holy the, shit, guys. Lando. Oh, all the stormtroopers are gambling. And are also samurai. That's badass. Whoa. <laughs> I love the selective color. 
just immediately wreaking that... havoc, shooting guns in oh, the air. Oh yeah, okay. So it's like a different shogunate coming into town. Last remnants of the war, so it's all already over. あの村を任せて逃げるとは。親父も飛んで顔知るけどな。ナイス。Is he force sensitive too? I don't think so. He's just a brave kid. The nameless warrior will help them. Oh. Ah. Oh shit! Oh, nice scene. I love the sh how the shots are in color. The bullets. Yeah, I mean, the yeah. lasers. Like the electricity, the like white. Hey! Whoa. Get him! This is great. It looks Ooh. like a bunch of sketch drawings, man. It's so cool. I know. It's very Seven Samurai vibes, right? Yeah, now. yeah. That's what I was gonna say. Are they yeah. doing Seven Samurai? Yeah, it seems like it. Yo, the droids going to town with like <laughs> seemingly melee weapons. Why is this guy so cool? He's just so fucking cool, man. So cool. He's not about that violent life no more. Oh shit. Oh man. Oh is and it heels? Do it. Is this heels, Wonder girl? Woman? Sith and heels? Yes. The music. Hey. What's his name? Barbara. He's one not he. He's one of the bounty hunters yeah. his, his race is an empire. Same for him. Oh, what? Oh, like an umbrella. What? Sitka. All right, now you need to get involved. Ronin. Oh, this is so sick. Ronin is a samurai without a master. Yeah. Uh, this is where you just put a pot on and walked out. Oh yeah, these are all the bounty hunters yeah. of the empire, or they seem to be. Oh, shit. Too late for close. What a cool looking Sith. Looks like a burka. Oh. Damn. What? Oh my god. Wow. She just split them in pieces. Terrifying. Yeah. So Bro, boss. What? I'm ready for this. Let's go. This is going to be a great ride, man. I'm excited for all these episodes now. Yeah. If it's going to be like this. <laughs> He looks so fed up already. <laughs> yeah. Look at her umbrella lightsaber. Right. She's also grievous shit, bro. Oh, what? Bro, come on. Oh, it's like a splitter. That's so cool. Yeah. She likes to go old school sometimes. Oh, yes. That's so sick. I love that shot. Dude. This is an old school Jedi, man. He's so cool looking. I know. So slow! Katana lightsaber. <laughs> oh! Bro, she's a no Jedi. <laughs> That's just such a popular sword unsheathing shot. Oh! Jesus! The sound design is so good. Was your Sith, Sith turn good? Oh, damn. Nice. This is sweet. This is where the sound design always excels with Star Wars, man. Yeah, it always has production value. Oh! <laughs> oh Damn, he got struck. I mean, he put his hey. arms up. I don't know what that was going to happen. Oh, it looked like uh, Sebulba. Sebulba. It did. Or one of his races. Yeah, yeah. The stylistic color choice is great. I, 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 know. I love it. Yeah. I know it seems very simple, but it's. It looks great. It's everything. Ah! <laughs> Bro. This is epic. Ooh! Oh. That was a close one. On a log, dude. Oh, we're on, on a waterfall. Let's yeah. go. This has already got Anakin Obi Wan beat, part one at least. She's doing this on heels. That was Guys. controversial, on I know. Heels. I'm sorry. It's just the Anakin Obi Wan <laughs> one was so long. <laughs> No. No. I like that. It's so sick. <laughs> the subs are, are better, I think, because, I don't know, dub, I don't know. It wouldn't sound as authentic. 
For this especially. Mm -hmm. What's who's somebody tea out going off? Why'd he put it away? He's doing the classic draw and kill. There's a word for that in Japanese, I can't remember. I ain't dropping shit, bitch. Oh, what is what that? Droid Sama. Droid Sama. Hey. <laughs> Droid Chan. <laughs> Whoa! Mando! Yeah, nice. Whoa. Not me. What do you call those? Yeah, Fucking I can't remember. Whistling, whistling yeah. birds or something? Yeah, something. Yeah. That's it. You're fucked. <laughs> oh shit, bro. Nah, no, right. he good. He good. He good. Yeah, kind of. I know you saw that waterfall. It's so fucking sick, bro. I want a lightsaber sheath that looks like a samurai sword. Fucking katana, man. So boss. Oh. <laughs> Better drop a log on you. Uh oh. Nice! That is so sweet! <laughs> yeah, what? Oh! You Got already did. Her. Yep. Took the bait. He had two? He's got the yeah. short one and the longer yep. one. Uh, it's a katana and then a wakizashi, which is the shorter sword. And then there's a tanto, which is more like a dagger. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, what's the technology behind that splitter? This is what Yasuke was trying to do. <laughs> like the robots and shit. Crow. <laughs> I'm just a wanderer. Nah. Have Take we, that crystal oh, real yeah. quick. Kyber crystal. Have we ever seen a like- Ooh, Oh damn. my god. Have Bro. we ever seen a reformed Sith? I don't think so. Or like mm -hmm. a- So is he like hunting Sith? Sith? Bro, he's collecting Pokemon badges out here, dog. Kyber crystals to make lightsabers. Right, but did he get them all from Sith? I would assume yeah. so, yeah. I don't know if he used to be one himself or just force sensitive and killed a bunch of Sith. I, I'd like to think he's a reformed Sith. So I think that his implication is he's not a Sith, but he's not a Jedi either. He's just somebody who's like a badass and mildly he's Ronin. Yeah. He's Ronin. Yeah. He's a swordsman yeah. that, that stumbled upon a lightsaber. He, he's in between. Yeah, he's so a Ronin. I think he's just like a he, he, he blocked that lightsaber with he did. like strong force, but no training. Right, right. Agreed. So like he developed his own fighting style with force. Because the yeah. force is all around us. Someone normal could presumably yeah. learn how to yeah. like block it. Yeah, like that. it, it that's very, why his fighting is so like unconventional. Very yeah. similar to Donnie Yen's yeah, character in Rogue One. You know, mm -hmm. he was mildly force sensitive, but he didn't. He wasn't a Jedi. He wasn't a Sith either. Kind yeah. of a thing. Yeah, but like, like Bodhisattva. With right. as good as fighting as he was, if he would have had a lightsaber, we'd be like, oh shit. You know what I mean? Like, right. That's he. I guess you can be force sensitive and you need that formal training to become a Jedi, but this dude's just like, nah, bro, I've just been murdering Sith, dog. Like, <laughs> yeah. Stalking was like, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm actually out of space if you want this extra yeah. one. <laughs> yeah, right. What are you buying? Yeah, that's exactly what <laughs> You buying Kyber crystals? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the art style, even though it was CG, was still very well done. It, Excellent. it was I love it. drawn on the paper. Mm -hmm. I love it. The use of color was like the obvious choice of what to make you know what to put in color but mm -hmm. i think i think that's awesome i think you, you can't have a lightsaber without showing some light like sure. some color even though seeing an inked lightsaber might have been cool as well but it would have been hard to uh well because like they the whole purpose of his lightsaber being red is like a key character moment for him mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so they would have had to they would have to say it and this way everybody you show don't tell like he whips out the red lightsaber and it tells you everything you need to know about yeah. it. it's like it's oh, so dope you. like you're a good guy but you got a red lightsaber like that's it's so yeah. dope. I think this is exactly what we wanted. Just like, just completely disconnected from everything. It's just like, just a little day in the life of this planet, you know? Right. Like, it's exactly. fucking village. Almost yeah. Just out here. Yeah. It's, they were definitely doing some se a Seven Samurai. Oh, uh, yeah. They, they've done totally. Seven Samurai a lot. This was more just like one of your classic old Shogun like it, films. You it, know what I mean? It, it, the Star Wars was kind of based on. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. It pulled yeah. inspiration from each. And I think what you and I are recognizing is when they, the villagers kind of yeah, like rose up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. then yeah. all of the random bounty yeah. hunter characters came yeah. out and yeah. started fighting for yeah. them. That's very Seven Samurai. But yeah, it concluded with the yeah. traditional like Western slash Japanese style 
duel in the in the town and they had all well, I, everywhere I, I, those I, characters I, that look like uh, Boz, I think that was his name, mm-hmm. uh, yeah. the name of the um, lizard looking dude. I, I but like they got like the different races that we've seen before, all as different bounty hunters, mm-hmm. which is like tight. So that's very Seven Samurai. Yeah, like my bad. Boba I, I just like we've seen this specific story of Seven Samurai in Star Wars media so much now it's because he loves it. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. It, it's it's a great yeah. thing to draw inspiration from, but I kind of like. I think we have seen all the possible best ways to do it now between Clone Wars, Mandalorian, and this. They all have had episodes ba- based yeah. off Seven Samurai. Mm-hmm. So, so, like, Jesus Christ, you son of a bitch! If he's talking about the gnat, <laughs> not me. <laughs> don't do Seven out. Samurai! It blew into my face. No, I just, I, I'm just saying this was great. I don't want to see another Seven Samurai thing based in the Star Wars universe because we've sure. seen yeah. it. Three iterations. Uh, of we could also give it maybe some of the good, the bad, and the ugly vibes, or like mm-hmm. fistful of dollars. Oh, yeah, you know, the man with no name who wanders into this uh, yes. fucking out town on the outskirts and yes. definitely some gotta, spaghetti uh, western. You know, vibes. get into it. But I mean, also westerns are they're all based off of the same shit. Yeah, but yeah, they, so, they I mean, all but inspire each other. I did really, really like this. I like the uh, fight. I like the 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 geometry of the fight like putting it mm-hmm. onto the water with the log and then off of the waterfall and all Split, that splitting the waterfall with the she, I thought yeah. she was gonna use the log to really cool. to like bring him, it down but yeah. no she just used it to block the current yeah and, and for her though oh, I'm sorry Darren is that like she's silly she thought he was just standing there with his lightsaber perfectly still like waiting like she got she got baited you mm-hmm. know what I mean she was like mm-hmm. easy and then she saw the log she's like I'm so fucking smart yeah <laughs> right. and then one's in there and that was it I thought she was he was gonna impale her like as soon as like the missile came that she didn't hear it coming right and that when she like went for the missile she was gonna turn around that's like, what I thought yeah, yeah. Or he'd be like <laughs> through he, yeah. he wanted to make it more classier than that yeah yeah so, so I'm gonna get you behind a waterfall where there's a uh, there's always something behind a waterfall I'm conditioned to believe that every <laughs> yeah. single waterfall every has video behind. game Zelda, yeah. Zelda every video game Zelda. every waterfall I see I got you Niagara Falls has a whole City behind it, there's no way you're gonna convince me. To <laughs> it's Atlantis, it does, man. it's Atlantis City. The fucking it, tunnels, that's yeah. right there. Yeah. It's the great tunnel. Um, one thing I did notice a little world building thing that I've never noticed in Star Wars I don't know how, probably because this is they've retconned it in. All the lasers were different colors, so they were green and yeah. blue and red. They actually had some yellow ones, too. Oh, they did have yellow yeah. ones? Oh, okay, okay. Because I was going to say, it resembled like all the colors of a lightsaber, which makes sense because if it's all the same tech, you know, if it's mm-hmm. all laser tech, then I could see how they would be like all the same colors. So mm-hmm. it was just interesting to notice that. Mm-hmm. I, I also very much like the design of the villain. Like, oh, you, yeah. know, you, you don't see that kind of uh, Sith too often. Even her hair when, when, yeah. she, when she took all of her armor uh-huh. and cloaks yeah. off. Like, I, I, um, she's a villain that's here for a tiny bit, but super badass. She's super cool. Kind of got an iconic look. Almost got, like, the Bendy. Almost got, like, the mm-hmm. Burka. Almost has a fro. The umbra- I look at, also, <laughs> every character is so kind of ethnically ambiguous. Uh-huh. Yeah. Even the villagers looked like they could have been, Anything. like... Yeah, from any, any, yeah, any, the, any walks of life. Right. It, it just doesn't matter. But mm-hmm. and her um, umbrella lightsaber also was it, very... Yeah, that character design is sick. I just wanted to, want to hear a glimpse of what this might have sounded like in English. Just to see if it was would be up to snuff. You want to judge it. For Japanese, I, yeah, I love that we watched it. You don't look like one of the villagers. Not bad. It's not bad. That's not bad. It's yeah, good. that's not terrible. Oh, you see the Darth Vader? Hold on. Yeah, Go yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. Go back to the Easter yeah. egg. I, I, Y'all I, see the fucking poster for A New Hope back yeah, in yeah. What the hell? That is A New Hope right there. That's that the original Star Wars. That is Star fantastic. Yeah. That's you great. would never notice it because you're looking uh-huh. at this ridiculous lightsaber umbrella. Yeah. Your eyes are right there, but there's no way in hell. That's you know, awesome. On top of the building there, it kind of looks like the Akira motorcycle. You just see what I mean? Like kind of uh, middle yeah, frame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It almost looks like it. <laughs> a little bit, Because you know yeah. they did that in Blade Runner? They put the Millennium Falcon is in Blade Runner no. in the opening scene. You it's attached a to a building. It. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, no. this was super good. I kind of got cold chills so at the end, just kind of thinking about like, damn man, that was that was fun. It was a fun ride. There must have been a lot more Easter eggs than that that we found. Right? Too. Yeah, so that's cool. They put these little little tiny nuggets in there for the super fans. You know? Yeah, definitely. The people going back and pausing like, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> also, yeah. I would love to have been the voice of Trooper B. Yeah, C, I'm wondering if C. I'm wondering if any of these names are canon with like the uh, bounty hunters from Empire. You know, yeah. the ones that we were talking about. Because I don't know any of the other character names or anything like that. I just know them. Does anybody ways. know who Brian T is? I can't think. No, I don't know. Well, she. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I thought I. We just heard a little bit of his English voice acting. I thought it was thought it was good. He yeah. sounded sounded familiar too. I they, bet it's someone we we never have heard before. Yeah. I'm looking. Oh, 
It's the bad guy from Fast and the Furious 3. No Tokyo fucking Drift. way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You run a spoon engines? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Beautiful. All right, yeah. right y'all. Well, we'll see you at the next one. Okay. Bye. 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 Thanks for watching Star Wars Visions with the Normies. Check us out on Patreon for early access and uncut content. Special shout out to our super patrons, Raga, Meshel, Clayton, Mr. Momus, Joe, and Keyboard Junkie. We will see you all next time.